I know Chiggs is in here recording this. No Chiggs moved in here, right? So whatever you oh, say. Sorry, you know Chiggs gonna have, have everything up there. Whatever you say, Chiggs gonna be on YouTube with it, man. Oh boy. Here we go. Boy, don't throw nothing on my jacket if it ain't come from me. These days, with everybody getting hit with so many essay lawsuits, you gotta be very careful what allegations you try to throw on somebody. Now, you guys all know Ken and Mace has a sports show. They just signed a crazy-ass deal a couple months ago with Underdog, and fans seem to be loving the show. It's not your typical sports show. They talk about everything else, talk about music, personal life. On one of their most recent episodes, they were talking about how they went to a whorehouse ended up taking the chick from there back home and running the train on her now initially everybody thought the story was pretty funny especially how cam described mace and what he did during the session now they spoke on this and brought it up on a joe button podcast melissa ford m4 she decided to give a very scathing hot take about this situation here's what she said i don't think that's right what you're doing i don't think that's right well who's doing what's you doing i don't what? think that's right like I them niggas clearly went to a whorehouse yeah. and took somebody up out of here says them and, that's who told and, the story. And, and, but that's, and who just, but that's who told I the story. I get that. I get that. So, of course, it says no. Who well, else is, is there? Is, the, is, there a, is there a distinct possibility that there may have been underage girls in that whorehouse? Oh, come hey, on. Come on now. Wait, 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 that's this, crazy. I don't know what you're doing. That's crazy. Yeah. crazy. Hell, what are you doing? Okay. I am. That now you know you said something fucked up when even Joe is going like, yo, you are going way too far, Melissa. Obviously, in this day and age, knowing how sensitive things are right now, if I'm just telling a story about me and my mans running the fast break on a chick, don't try to throw no extra sauce on it. Just leave the story the way it is. It was just that. We went there, met a girl, took her back clapped it and that was it knowing exactly how tempered cam can be he snaps at everybody for the slightest disrespect him and joe are still not on good terms everybody thought he was gonna go off and couldn't wait for his response well cam and mace responded on their show here's what they said no, look, I, got, I can't look, laugh last time we said something people took it way serious look we're we're just here to tell the truth. We're not we're not into anything illegal, so you can stop trying to put that together. Let me let me let me put you together right quick. Don't ever come for me and kill her. Now, ever and in, your nice about it. in your in your mother's life, nigga. This is not this, this is not what you yo, want. I promise you all the comments say, Ooh. <laughs> it's like, you like, picked I, the wrong people to fuck with. The wrong one. You cause I can't tell you how much I don't care. <laughs> I couldn't even tell you how much. <laughs> Yo, I, cause I'm gonna be honest with you. And he's more petty than Yo, I am. I'm gonna be so. honest with you. Only reason I'm I, and, and if need be, we will revisit this. If yeah, need be. We can revisit we, it. Yeah. But the whole thing, this 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 is screaming desperate and yeah. and, and attention like, yo, it really is. So I'm not gonna but if need be, Nigga, yeah. nigga, because niggas is looking for us on we this. We have season. never, ever, 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 ever tried to take nothing from nobody. Secondly, secondly, we only we, like people that that we, we love us whole, more we have, than we, have whole, we love ourselves. We have a whole segment on that. Secondly, who was looking out for us? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah we were young. Yeah, yeah, who was looking out for us when we was? Listen, man, we ain't gonna give it no attention, but tread lightly. Be tread careful. Lightly. Cause I'll tell you one thing I, I know a lot Ooh, of people are snipers ice Snipers and sharpshooters S Snipers, sharpshooters And I know people are ice I have you escorted back up across the border Be careful Be careful now, I also have to note that on the same podcast, same segment, Melissa Ford noted that she has not been to a whorehouse, which a lot of people called her out for saying, if you've never been there, how can you know what goes on in there? Now, I do like Melissa on the podcast. I think she's very talented, but I think this is something she has to kind of issue an apology for. As men, there are certain things that you don't even play with, and I think this is one of those things. But Cam, come on, bro. Don't call ice on her, man. That was going too far. Tell me what you guys think about this, man. What do you guys think about Cam and Mace's respond back to Melissa? Do you guys think she crossed the line and she needs to apologize for that? Or is this just now part of the podcasting game to give a scathing hot take for the sake of conversation? Push comments below. Subscribe to my channel like this video. I'll see you guys later.